breakfast time in the Crocker yeah. household. Um, so, we know that it may sound like there's an old 1957 Chevy running in the background. We now have a Vornado. <laughs> Maybe be quieter. Yeah, we got that for you guys uh, because we do know that fan is super loud. It's not the AC or anything. It's that fan. Um, it's got the got the Vornado. Shout out to my mom. She loves her Vornado. And I was like, baby, we got to get it. So, um, yeah, just eating some breakfast. And then... What? We would never... Never. Not eat breakfast. Um, and then another busy work day ahead of us yeah very excited about what we're doing just kind of wrapping up the uh, zip system and then mm. you guys know by now all the landscaping we're doing it's a lot yeah um but again just pumped on it so every work day gotta start out with a great breakfast yeah oatmeal just kind of sticks to the gut you know it's like peanut butter that's right Sorry if the air compressor is kind of loud, but uh, looking at the pond, I was kind of hoping we would wake up and be a, just a little bit of water in there, so that way we know there's some water underground. Yeah, I don't but, think there's, we were kind of hoping because it's been wet since we got the property. Yeah, that's one that hasn't dried out. I think it was just packed in so well yeah. that it just held water, but yeah. uh, we'll get it all cleaned up and everything, and then uh, I think we're supposed to have a little bit of rain. Saturday, I yeah. believe. Yeah. We'll kind of see at that point how much it rains and what it does. Yeah. But uh, it'd be cool to see this thing full someday. Oh. This is like, once we picked out this spot uh, for the tiny house, we immediately, our brains were like, this would be an awesome to like make it. I don't know. I don't want to go in too much detail to give it all away. Yeah. It's going to be cool. It's going to be awesome. You eating a steak? While Jason is editing right now, um, I say we bring breakfast some uh, leftovers. <sighs> All right, so we got, um, I'll show you guys. We got some cantaloupe, some pickle, some of those nasty, oh, you gonna try it out? <laughs> some of those nasty things from the snack crate. And breakfast and Hank are ready. Come oh, on, buddy. Um, I don't know how I'm going to get in the gate without spilling this soup that I made for them, but we're gonna try. <laughs> Looks like they love it, huh? That's some good stuff. <laughs> you like cantaloupe breakfast? Oh, turkey's over there getting. getting all of in there. <laughs> so it looks like they loved it. Um, now I gotta clean the shop up. It is in real bad shape. Um, at least start to burn all the trash and everything like that. It is uh, it's pretty bad in here. I think this time after we clean it, it'll probably stay halfway decent since we're not living in it. Um, so Time to get to work. Look who's done editing. Uh, he just came in and helped out over there. Um, Man, I didn't do much, you did all this. Well, baby, you helped me. The only thing I said was, whoa, 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 whoa. She had a fire going like 50 feet in the air. I said, what you trying to do? 
burned down Shoe Dang Ranch? And she said, maybe. Is that Jay Cool? I'm old. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it looks a lot better. Obviously, we still got a lot more to do in here, um, especially yeah. the tool bench area. But, I mean, this is a start. It's a lot better. And, again, I think since we're not in here constantly. Yeah, it won't be bad anymore. Yeah, it'll be a lot easier maintained. So. I think it looks a million times better. Yeah. Just pulling it up, you could just tell. Yeah. So. Um, also, hey, you're welcome. You're working, so I work. Uh, the viewers recommended that we downloaded, download this app mm -hmm. that helps identify the plants. I say we go see if it works on those possible sand plums, possible apricot, do we possible need, peach, poss possible nectar. Do we peach. need internet? Oh, there's only one way to find out. I don't know. You tell me. Red. Oh, yes. look at that one back there. I thought we were growing wild plums, but I guess we're doing cherries. <laughs> Holy cow. That thing is bright red. Yeah. These things are, uh, I mean, they're looking good. When we were at the house the other day, no. Maybe? I don't know. I, I googled um, sand plums. I never knew that's what they're actually called. Mm -hmm. That's and, what, uh, I mean, that's what everybody's saying. Yeah. So that's what we're assuming. I just never heard it called that. And it looks just like it. So yeah. we're going to see if this app works. What's the app called? Picture this. Ooh. Um, again, oh, I have one bar. Let's look, my hands are nasty. Why are you nasty? I've been cleaning them. Um, but yeah, the, right over there, there's a whole bunch of them. Um, and then we found, again, more trees up there are the same. So it'd be cool if this works. We could really go identify all the stuff because we're not, when it comes to this stuff, this is not our specialty. No, you guys know. Yeah. I feel, no, I think we might have to have service to do these. Dang it. You can't just like take a picture and do it later? I guess we can try that when we go into town. Yeah. Like just of the leaves, I'm guessing? Maybe. I'll take a picture of that. And then, and then maybe take leaves a, and... Take a picture of these just because it's... <laughs> because why? Because they look like nuts. <laughs> You're stupid. Okay. So. So, we'll try that. And then we'll let you guys know. Yeah. Uh, it'd be really cool. It'd be really dumb if you have to have a service every time you use it. Because if you're out in the wild, how are we going to do that do again? Yeah, that's how I know she's mad at me when I say something to her. She's like, "No, that's my favorite thing to do." I mean, this one kind of feels soft. Try it. What's the worst gonna happen? You have diarrhea. You already have diarrhea. What are you oh, doing? it's leaking. Ooh, this looks like a tomato. I was about to say that looks like a cherry tomato. Should I do it? Yeah. Just a, not the whole thing. What are you doing? It's squirting. <laughs> well, apparently you're not supposed to get the red cherry looking ones. Yeah, it's it's like a grape. Yeah. Got some right there. Oh, see, it's got a... Oh. It does have a... That does look like a... Little plum. Yeah, or a peach. What is it? You can try it right there. I already dropped it on the ground. That's the insides. My hands are nasty. I guess that real red one. It's got somewhat of a... It's not bad. Um, Sweet? Yeah. yeah it's like... The more it's like in your mouth, the sweeter it gets. It's like your kisses. Baby. <laughs> I, uh... Whoa. Um, forgot what I was saying. Okay. See, sometimes I distract her when I say cute things like, your kisses are sweet on the inside of my mouth. Give me one. All right, guys. I'm getting a jaw workout right now. What? Um, we got some uh, double Bu bubble. Double bubble. A whole bag of it. It's been so long since I've had double bubble. Tastes so good, so hard to chew. Do you remember the flavored ones? That was, those were the best. The green the ones. Oh, the grape was good too. The grape or the, yeah, the green with the apple. But anyway, guys, got something for 
the home sweet home. Um, and yes, it has to do with toilet paper, with pooping. Um, it ain't a crocker video unless you poop it. Or so, can poop. Yeah. I actually or got this. Or a nim can poop. Baby, that was really good. Um, so, you wanna, you wanna show the people? It's a toilet paper holder, but. I, I thought it was a mic stand. When I'm sitting on the toilet and I'm singing my songs in the AC. <laughs> I don't even need instructions. I'm going to figure this out right now. You never use instructions, but. I'm a man, baby. Um, I saw this on Amazon. I thought it would be kind of perfect. It's small space, it's small, and it will hold toilet paper. And we end and, up pooping. And there we go. So, ooh, easy setup. I'm a hoping, uh. Here's a little. Okay, that's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Paper ant. So while Jason is uh, just working hard on setting that up for us. Every day I'm working. Every day. Um, we got some candles in the mail. They're not real, but. Um, They're real to us. Yeah. I just I'm gonna get a, break them out, and uh, I feel like it's gonna we can have like a romantic. Hey baby. Well, leave one on the table and then kind of around the bed. Oh, baby. I thought it was going to be in the bathtub. We're going to sit in the bathtub together. Baby. That would be fun. <laughs> Whoa. How are you doing? <laughs> baby, I'm out of toilet paper. We got, we got roll over there. Don't show them that one. We're so, out of toilet paper. Oh. What, what are we, we going to do? do? This is how it works. It's pretty cool. Just come straight up, just pop it over, boomage. But the big question is, over or under? Guys, when you do it, is it over or you have the toilet paper to where it's under? These are, these are the questions. I'm going to tell you right now, it's over. That way you just it's over. So I mean that space wise, that is yeah, pretty that's good. A, and we can kinda of get in the corner a little bit more. Well, because that's something we actually uh, we're talking about. We're like, oh, it's not a very big area. What do we do? Mm -hmm. You found this one on Amazon. Yeah, I mean that's pretty perfect. Um this I is might what have we, some stains in here. I'm gonna close that up. Maybe. This is what we were using, which we can go ahead and set that up too. Um so, we still got water in here because we're not really level, so it kind of stayed right there. But. We're working on it. We're working on it. Um, let's set up this little basket. How are we gonna make it stay? It's sticky. Mm. Only one way to find out. All right guys, so it has different suction things, but you can't suction on this, so we put the sticky stick sides on there and uh, we get one shot do not miss your chance I'm not trying not to. because it'll rip this wallpaper right off <laughs> all right about here I think it's pretty good this bubble gum's so good right there right there <gasps> Not right there. Just kidding. I don't know if I'm able to get this all the way flat. Oh, there it goes. Oop. You look so good in that shirt. There you go. Now we can hold our brazos. We got. We got more on the side by side. With my dirty fingernails, I haven't used Brazos Valley soap yet. You haven't showered today. No, I will. Oh. You guys, this is, you guys know uh, Jason likes the lemongrass. I do, but I also like the island something. Island boy? I'm an island boy. Um, I forgot which one it's called. The, it's a blue one, it's island. Island was, something. Yeah. 
but this the lavender chamomile. So it is pretty this good. one and then the strawberry champagne, yeah. those are my favorite. And then we have Dawn dish soap because I saw a video if you get into poison ivy, if you use Dawn dish soap, it's all about you don't just because you hit the plant, I mean you're gonna get the rash. It's more of you have to get the oils off of you between two and eight hours yeah. before it starts to really do stuff. So we got a little Dawn dish soap in here. Yeah, was, um, I thought I might have gotten into it yesterday. Yeah. But I don't know. Or maybe if i was like eating before and then we're trying to conserve water so then i'm just showering and then when the water your plate yeah when it comes off my my head my my mullet then it gets on the plate and i kind of just that's i mean that's ingenious how we use and reuse that's right that's what i was trying to i could not think of what it's called oh yeah guys um update on the tornado it sounds a lot better in here doesn't it <laughs> 